Hello. <laughs> Imagine if I started my intro like that. Come on. What is going on, fellas? And welcome back to the Southland Koalas. We are going to get our ass kicked today. I initially scheduled Georgia because they started the season at rank one. Somehow, some way, they've lost two games to start out the season. Oh, they lost to AM and South Carolina? Yikes. Well, if you did not catch episode one, I definitely recommend you go check it out because it was a huge introduction. And uh, if you're going to follow the series, you should probably know about it. So as you can see, after this, we have an easier game. We have UNLV, ECU, and then FCS. In fact, we have four easy games after this. We are in the Sun Belt Conference. That's one thing I forgot to say. And you'll notice down here, we have ASU. And that ASU is none other than Appalachian... App? Is it... I've heard it said before. Appalachian or Appalachian? But either way, they are in the dynasty. Oh yeah, I completely nerfed for recruiting. Like, wait until you check this out, mate. So the way it's gonna go down is the way we can extend this out. We're gonna be allowed three two-star players, I think I made it, which are gonna be Chris Green, Jermaine Gay, and Doug Jones. After those three two-star players, everybody's gonna be a one-star. And I figured just so we could at least have something to be excited for, we would have one three-star player each year. I did find Brian Washington though. I said to you guys I really wanted to get a fast safety for my user. This guy runs a 438. 85 acceleration, mate. This is our guy right here. Obviously, I do want to cap us a little bit in terms of our points. Uh, I don't really want to go spending the full 5,000. I'm not sure how many I'm going to limit we can go after. But either way, the players that do leave will be replaced by more walk-ons. So, it makes it harder. Jermaine again. This is meant to be our new quarterback. He's got some decent excel. Like, he is a scrambling quarterback. He just has horrible passing stats. Chris Green looking pretty good. He's a 59. David Jackson. <laughs> he looks pretty good as well. And Trenton Wilson. I like him. Looks like a stud. Brian Washington is by far the best player on the Highland Spring Springers. Though they've only won half of their games, it's still definitely a big increase over the team's prior success. And all of that can go to Brian Washington. Initially, he didn't make the team standing 5'9", 170 pounds, but after some injuries to the secondary, they needed some help. Ever since Brian has been on the team, they have not looked back. Earning his spot as the number one corner on the team, and we will see how they can finish the season. But for now, the koalas are definitely interested. The one and only thing we are left to check out. And boy, let me tell you. I changed around the sliders. I said I was going to do so. That game against Utah was like too close for my liking. So in the interest of making it extremely challenging, I got a guy called J Kit Sliders. They're on Operation Sports. I'll link them down below. These are meant to be super challenging for the user. And it's meant to buff the computer a little bit. It just makes the whole game a lot more realistic. So you can see our quarterback accuracy is crap. Like, as if it wasn't hard enough to throw it with our quarterback. Our rush defense goes up to 65. That is the only thing that gets a buff. Everything else is dropped dramatically. Check it out, the computer sliders. They too drop down to five on quarterback accuracy. But as you can see, running back ability is on 90. Rush defense is on 90. These were the sliders that I was testing out in the other dynasty. And I really, really like them. I think these are legit. If you are new around here and you enjoy Madden and NCAA content, this is the channel for you. Don't forget to sub. Thank you guys so much for the support on the first episode. I was super nervous about dropping it because it took so much time. I, I just wanted it to be good. And you guys loved it, mate. So thank you very much for that. If you want to follow me on social media, all of my links are down in the didgeridoo. And without further ado, fellas, let's go test out these sliders. This one is going to be ugly. At least it's not raining this time. This should mean Joe Miller can maybe make some more passes than he did before. <laughs> Which was awful. Nice blocking. Let's go, Allen, up the sideline. All the way to the 40. Wow, we made one yard. I don't even know who we're going to go to. It's man coverage. Take off, Joe! No! We weren't, we weren't even faster than the D lineman, though. So even though it's fourth down, we are already doing better than before. We made a yard. That is positive for us. 12 mile per hour wins. My goodness. That nearly got blocked. Oh! Oh, come on. They're just going to keep running it. That is Georgia's strategy. Here we go. 
Make the play. Oh my goodness, he broke two tackles. It's deja vu. Their first play in both games goes for a touchdown. That is just sickening. It seems stupid, but we need to try and establish the run game. They're going to blitz. We're, they're, they're in the backfield. We need better blockers. I think next episode, we will definitely be looking at some one-star offensive linemen. Because we need them. Desperately. Here we go. Wow. How did you mess up that simple slant? Well, forget that positive yardage. <laughs> that doesn't exist. Got him! Oh, he just overshot it! We were so close to getting that first! They nearly blocked it again! What's wrong with these people, mate? I'm waiting for the screenplay. Come on, too slow! Oh! Oh man, I thought he was going to throw it to my guy, we would have picked six that. I really want to get Brian Washington, because if we can get him, put him at safety, we're going to have good enough speed to be able to make some plays out there. That'll be the day. Run again. There we go, Barkley, good setup. Oh, oh no, <laughs> number 23. Will Tobias can't come up with the pick. He had two chances at it as well. Drop both of them, the bloody goose. Imagine how hyped that would have been. Who's going to get the first pick? Probably going to come next episode with the easier games. Nope. Another first down. Run, run, run. Come on, come on, Barkley. Oh, he ran into a brick wall. We're already at such a big disadvantage now with the sliders as well. But we're still able to make tackles like... As unlikely as it is, we can still win games. Pass. Oh, come on! Oh, Johnny Rutherford got burnt. The man with the best speed goes down. Holy crap, that guy is scary. No wonder we're getting sacked in the backfield. That's who we have to go up against? Oh, wow, he turns so slow, man. Oh, there we go. Big first down for the koalas. I'm surprised banana... Oh, there we go. As soon as I go to bring it up, it comes out. Wow. <laughs> Running straight into a blitz. I think I might change this up. R1. Whoa! That was nowhere near where it needed to go. Mech coverage, dang it. Go, Miller. Run, run, run! Come on, we're not going to be able to get around. He fumbled it. Why... <laughs> Man, we can just not catch a break, bro. <laughs> this is definitely the hardest thing I've ever done. Way harder than that Taco Dynasty. There we go, we're in the backfield! Second and 13, good play. Gotta have trust, that's it. Just gotta trust the team, forehead. Oh, he's trying to take off, come on! Yes! We sacked him, third and 15 now. What an extremely weird change of events on this drive. We got two back-to-back -back loss of yards. All right, here we go, boys. Can we get a stop? I'm jumping on Houdini. I'm locking everybody up. Look, oh, <laughs> we nearly had another pick, bro. They are really flirting with the idea of a turnover. It just sucks because we can't catch anything. That 40 accuracy, though. All right, let's try the option. Because <laughs> this will work. Up. Okay, instant shed. Go on one. Oh, my goodness. I really hate Joe Miller. Like, hate is such a strong word. But it's the only word I can use to describe him. Even if you make the right read, there is just no chance of you even completing the pass. Yep, there goes another sack. Throw that away. Now let's see if we can get ourselves an interception. Unlike last drive. I've got faith. I reckon we genuinely could get it. Run play again. Ah, there we go. Good stop, good stop. Bananas on the sideline. Like, why the hell did I sign here? Watch out for the tight end. Oh, crap. 
It's a run play! Oh! We're not gonna send the blitz because there's no point. Like, it doesn't matter if we send seven. I'm on it. Oh my goodness, he's gonna get sacked! Let's go, man! That's what I'm talking about, boys. Took away the slant route with the user. Standing there looking cross-eyed in the pocket. Wow, 10 yards. <laughs> I'm so proud of this. I think our best bet might be a drag route. Honestly, that's... Oh, oh, he dropped it. Okay. I guess I'm asking for too much. Man coverage? No, it's not. Come on! Oh, we had a chance. We had a window. Joe Miller is a 1 from 10, bro. If we throw it over 5 yards, his accuracy does not exist. I'm there with Wyatt. Uh-oh. Yep, that's a touchdown. They just know to send the blitz because they know we can't pass it. Like, oh my... Oh, he broke a tackle. Imagine Rexton breaking that. Oh, I didn't even pass it to Gilroy. I want to try and milkshake special it, but I'm going to give it to the fullback. I reckon we can get this first down. Go, 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 come on, Laurinaitis! Yes! First and ten. Our first of the game. Go up, somebody. Oh, got it off! <laughs> Just threw it in the triple coverage. The run game is not working, what are we going to do? I know, let's call a jet sweep play. Because this will work. Go, go, go. Oh my goodness. That actually was pretty good. It's all up to Andrew McGrath, the best player on the team. Nice, look at that bounce. Oh my goodness! <gasps> Bro, give me my crown. Give me my bloody crown. This is the strategy right here. Just try and pin them back. They're going to run it. We can get two points here on Georgia. Go, 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 go. Oh, I should have known better. Wow, bro, come on. He's going to go 99 yards to finish the half. At half time, Georgia up 28-0. Can Southland bounce back? We just need one TFL. That's all we need. We're not going to get it. Why does it seem like when they're more pinned back, they're more likely to score? I like how they also changed their approach. They're no longer going with the hurry up offense. They're just kind of chilling now. They're like, oh, we already won the game. Run play. Yes, third and three. Go, 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 go. I'm in the backfield. Let's go, Austin Land. That is what I'm talking about, bro. Fourth and seven. We're talking smack. Imagine talking smack to Georgia right now. All right, we have great field position. Nice pancake. Wow. Okay, we just got to gain like one first down. We might be able to get a touchdown. Take that. Let's go, Laurinaitis. What a beast. He even broke a tackle. I think this is the strategy. Just, it's got to be really, really short passes. Oh, look at that. Oh! Bro, we fit it in over the head and he just dropped it like that. Uh, dang it. All right, we're going to have to punt it. Oh, Banana Crow. With the big boy balls. He wants to go for it. He's fed up. He's so angry right now. You already know. And the pass is overthrown. That could have been a first down. I appreciate that though. Obviously, Banana wants to... He doesn't want to back down like a little girl. There we go. Another TFL. I feel like they're kind of just not trying now. It's like, that could be a big reason why... Come on, Wyatt, make a play. I'm on that. No, I'm not. I'm too slow. He gets stiff armed. Ah. Yep. What's new? <laughs> Come on, wow, Wyatt missed it. Dang it. 35 to 0. We're out of the game. But I feel like we can score, man. We've seen some decent plays. Let's go, Alan. Banana's just given up on running the ball completely. He doesn't even want to do it anymore. Everything is just a pass play now. You see how fast he just zigged around there? That's crazy. All right, Laurinaitis, you're the first man up. 
We can't throw it over five yards, so you gotta be the guy. Oh, I got square. No, I don't. Oh, no squiggly line cheese. It's almost like they don't care anymore. There we go. Uh-oh. Oh, I thought he... I thought he was going the other direction. The big steroid guy got a pick. Well, if Joe Miller already wasn't having a horrible day, you can add an interception to that now. Oh, I'm on the D-line. Trip him over! Yes, it actually worked. Wow, you guys are, are scared, mate. You know you can't pass it on us. Come on, it's going to be another run, ain't it? Yeah, th there's no way we're going to be able to get a TFL. How did... What? Bro, that is the most broken thing I've ever seen in this game. We're only down 42. We could definitely come back. Oh, oh he broke it. Let's go, Rexton. And we got a block? Dang, man, I see you, bro. I can't believe I got so hyped over a six-yard run. But that's how grueling this is. If you get six yards, you you lose your damn mind. Throw it, fit it in there. Phoenix. That's a dot. We had circle. I just did not trust the arm power. Is it kind of sick that my favorite part of the game is punting the ball? <laughs> like, punting the ball is the funnest thing because it's the only thing I'm good at. Or this team can do well. He's going to stop. Here comes the run, of course. Why would they... Oh, there we go. Tripped him over. Just throw your body into him. Oh, there we go. Oh, he didn't want to take that hit. I like that, man. That cover four really shut him down. They had nowhere to go. Let's try a cover three now. Oh, right over the... Bro, that's a laser. This guy has thrown it eight times, and they have 42 points. Like, <laughs> that's how bad this is right now. We're there, we're there, we're there. Yes! Okay. Uh-oh. There we go. One-on-one -on -one tackles, man! Banana Crow must have given him a mouthful at halftime, because this second half, we have done such a good job of tackling, man. Georgia is not struggling, but they're not moving the ball as efficient as what they were. Slant. Ah, nearly. Zone might be the move. Like, we might just start mixing it up a bit. I'm on that out. Oh, my goodness. If only we had a bit more speed. 32 didn't even try to make the tackle. Well, fellas, that is 50 points. Um... I think I'm going to go ahead and simulate the rest of this one because, like, we just got nothing out there, bro. The good news is, though, going into the next episode, we will be doing a double header, and we have UNLV and somebody else. I can't remember the other team, but we might have a chance to get a win or at least make the game close. Oh, thanks for that. All right, check it out the stats. <laughs> Our punter. Look at that. He threw six attempts. Wait, did Joe Miller get injured? I don't know what happened, but Joe threw five from 23. That's 21%. He had a lot more yards than I thought he did, honestly. On the rushing end, we pretty much went backwards. Austin Laurinaitis was seven. On the receiving end, check it out. Bruce Gilroy, 38 yards. Marshall Clemens. We have Avery Phoenix, Rexton Jones. Very evenly distributed. Phoenix dropped three passes though, man. If he caught those, he probably would have had 50 yards. On the defensive end, I got to really praise our team there. We had two sacks, which I never thought I would ever see. We didn't have any turnovers though. That is the problem. If you made it this far into the episode, you are the real MVP. Hope the rest of your day is awesome. And from me personally, I'm out. Peace. So bad, let it up and up since six, making hits like tennis. I've been on fire, I just need my credit. Wanna go far, need to change my settings. Reaching for the stars on my feet, touch heaven. Heaven, heaven.